Um, I think it was okay, oh, man. I, you know, I wanted to um, know how to take my time with him because I know he's gonna come out to fight. Um, um, I seen, you know, I seen, you know, what he did to, you know, Maidana. You know, he came out fast and you know he dropped Maidana and he put the heat on him early. That's how I wanted to take my time and just really work behind my jab. And um, and not open up too much, you know, so early, you know, because I don't want to try to kick through nothing crazy. So I just want to stay behind my defense and stay behind my jab. And I felt and I felt stronger than him, so I just kept walking down. And I knew eventually, you know, I was going to start jumping some hip and stuff on Hey, Andre, when you let your hands go, it looked like it was pretty much a wrap. Did yeah. you know it was going to be that easy once you open up? Uh, you know what? That was a game plan with Virgil, man. Virgil told me to take my time because he knows in the past, you know, I have a uh, uh, bad habits. He just really just going crazy. That's why he really wanted me to take my time. He knew I had a really, really tight jab. He wanted me to save out my jab. And after round after round, he his face kept it. And, you know, and after the 56th round, you know, Virgil told me, hey, uh, he started dropping the neck stuff on him. He started just that has to be a major confidence builder. How would you rate your performance? Um, I thought it was all right. I gave myself probably uh, probably seven to eight. I still got some improvement to do. That's why I've been out for like a year and a half. I came back with my other fight. You know, but this fight here was a fight that I really found somebody to, you know, really came with it. And at the same time, you know, this kid beat the guy that beat me. Come in and try to rough me. You know, I heard some things. You know, I heard that he was going to try to, you know, try some tactics like the Guerreros and the, and, the, and, the, and you know, guys in the past. So, so you know, I was prepared for it. Uh, he, was, he, was, he was complaining about the stoppage. What did he say? Did he, he was complaining about. Yeah. I mean, I mean, you seen what happened. I don't know if it, you know if he would have got back up. I mean, it looked like he barely got up the first time. But, right. but you know, I mean, he can complain all he wants to complain. I mean, I was gonna. Yeah, if they wouldn't have stopped, I probably would have really, you know, really hurt him. How soon do you want to return, and what, what do you think about possibly fighting against Sean Porter next? <laughs> uh, you know, we'll see. You know, right now, I'm a it's with the Tyler fam, and, uh, you know, whatever, you know, Al Heyman, you know, wants to try to get yeah, to the table. We're going to be up, uh, so we focus on it. Right? Yeah, as you can see, Ortiz, yeah. you know, we're feeling we're fast, next. we're feeling strong. So whoever they want to put up in front of me, right, let's go. Virgil, how would you rate this fight on a scale of one to ten? Probably like seven or eight. Thank you. Probably seven or eight. I think I, yeah, I think I showed. Um, um, I think I showed a lot of poise. Um, I think I showed, you know, a fast jab. Um, and, and I think I showed just me, you know, going into more of an intelligent fight about taking my time and breaking my opponent down instead of going crazy in the first couple of rounds. So, um, you know, about seven or eight. I still got a lot of food. What do you take from this fight? What do you take from this uh, fight going forward? Um, you know, just stay sharp, man. And, and, and you know, like I said, you know, still have you know, a lot of things to work on. And, 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 and you know, next fight, you know, you'll see. Just some changes. I do like the uh, Awesome. Awesome. It's crazy. It's crazy. Andre, um, were the rumors true at one point that you were willing to face Phil Brook? <laughs> you know, there's a lot of talk. You know, there's a lot of talk about it. Um, uh, you know, Kill Brook, I don't know his situation. Yeah, I heard he got stabbed or something like that. I heard he was, uh, you know, I mean, he was in the hospital, so, so I don't know about that in here. I don't know about that matchup, but that's something I definitely love to do. And what about the rematch with Victor Ortiz? I know that last time we spoke, you were pretty open to it. Are you yeah. still open to that? Yeah, if it makes sense. I mean, if it makes sense, I mean, like I said, you know, this kid here, you know, stopped Ortiz. You know, but Ortiz gave me my first loss. So I really came into this fight with a lot of passion and really tried to prove a point. And I think I did that tonight. So like I said, that fight makes sense. Yeah. Who do you want next? Do you feel like you have 
a better fighter now than when you were undefeated because of your experience and things like that? Yeah, for sure. You know, I've been through a lot. You know, I've been through a lot, and I think um, I've got a lot, a lot more focused at the fighter. Um, I'm thinking now that I'm just taking my time and really establishing my jab. Uh, and, um, and just really seeing things. It's not going to take things. Just, you know, being that young, rough, man, you know, strong fighter now, I can really just say some things. I'm going to take my time. I just know, it's in my mind, mind up and down. And I'm going to take my mind down. This was your second fight with trainer uh, Virgil Hunter. What how, what kind of differences is he making now in, in how you fight? Um, I just try to be smart. I mean, I guess, uh, the fact that you know, taking my time, taking my time, and, uh, you know, because he's seen, you know, when I came out the camp, my first time, all the guys, you know, I was athletic, and I uh, worked a lot of things, and I made a lot of mistakes. Like I knew he was gonna come out fast. Right. Okay, I see what he did in my dog. He always does. Yeah, no, he always comes out fast. Well, that's, that's one of the main reasons why we really work going to stay cool, staying calm, staying behind our defense. And if you, and if you can't win, then you don't know, stay in your own defense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,